right, so it's day three of our cruise on the MSC Seashore. And we are actually in Nassau today. So we've had an easy day so far, pretty easy. We got up late again. <laughs> we really slept in this time. Um. But we got up and had a late buffet, just a quick breakfast, quick muffin and what have you. And then we ran around doing our tour of the ship, which you'll see on a different later video. But that was kind of fun just yeah. to check out all, uh, make sure we saw all the areas and check out the whole ship. And uh, now we're relaxing. We think we're going to walk off and go into NASA just for a little bit. We want to check out their new area on the cruise terminal itself because they did build some different shops and things yeah, they, recently. They built the, um area where people mm -hmm. can just walk around shopping yeah. before they get off get out of the uh, security area right so we thought we would check that out and see what they did and i don't know we might go further into nasa we'll see someone said it's pretty hot there we've been in nasa several times right. so yeah. we're gonna see it may be that we just decide to come back to the ship because this is a great you know if you're not into nasa it's a great day just to have the ship more to, to yourself so we'll see how we feel, but yeah, we're gonna go check it out. Come on along. Let this happen to you. NASA spent $300 million upgrading their cruise port for, so far, and this is just phase one of the development. We were really impressed with this new cruise port. It's in a security area, so you don't have to worry about people haggling you anymore like it used to be. There's lots of shopping, some cute little quaint, Areas, uh, little bars, little kind of restaurants, and an amphitheater. And it's still, you know, near the area where you can go out to the straw market if you want to go and do some traditional Bahamas shopping. And it's right outside the gate, so that's really easy to get to. But yeah, we were just really impressed. There's new restrooms and there's an area you can get your hair braided, a huge hair braiding area. But yeah, we were able to find a little bar and had a Sands beer, which is the local Bahamas beer. And on the way back, we looked at all the cruise ships that were in port, it's really cool. Now they can get up to six ships at a time in port. After we got back, we sat on the balcony for a while and watched some of the ships sail away. It's always pretty to see them sail away at night. They're all lit up. And we even were able to see the MSC Magnifica, which we will be sailing on in the middle of January.
good. Ron loves cheesecake. Yep. I have it. Okay, we're back again. We're back from NASA, obviously. Actually, we forgot to do a follow-up on that, but we had a great time just kind of checking out the new port. Yeah, they they uh, mm -hmm. did the construction, I don't know, was it three years ago? I think so, about three they years ago. Now they're all done. Um, mm -hmm. So we checked that out. They really did a good, good job on the mm -hmm. construction. Good. Really nice with all the little new shops. Shops. And little restaurants. Little and, restaurants. And a couple yep. bars there. And an amphitheater. Mm -hmm. An amphitheater, yeah, yeah. And you could kind of look at, you know, benches everywhere. So you could kind of look at the water. and Just really nice. And you feel safe. You know, you're not yeah. bombarded by people. <laughs> so we just kind of stayed inside the port this time. time. Yeah. Especially because it was getting a little later and we didn't want to risk, you know, there were other ships in port, quite a few actually, but they were all coming back and we just didn't really want to risk walking around, especially because it was going to get dark. So, yeah. but we had fun. We had a beer there and yeah, relaxed. Yeah. And yeah. then we came back and got ready, obviously for, for dinner. Yeah. So we went to the restaurant again tonight for, for the dinner and it was really good. It was good. Good. Small thought, portions, but it was yeah. good. It was Caribbean dinner. And you know, it is white night on this cruise ship. And we didn't realize that before we left. So if you ever go on an MSC cruise, it's a good idea to bring some kind of white outfit. This is about as close as we could come. Yeah. <laughs> so, but they are having a little white night thing later up on deck. So we might go check that out. Right. There's not really a formal night. I think this is about as formal as it gets. Some people were really casual, so. Yeah. But that's okay. Yeah, that's, that's okay. Fine. But we had a good dinner. For the starters, we asked if we could have two. We were famished because we didn't have lunch today. <laughs> we were so busy running yeah. around. So we had, I had the guacamole and corn tortillas. And yep, so did Ron. Yep. And it, the guacamole was amazing. It was fresh. Yeah, it's fresh. Mm -hmm. yeah, the only thing I kind of wish they gave you a little bit more chips. Then yeah. we got three chips. Three chips. Four or five would be better. So. Exactly. I was thinking the same thing, and the chips were not super crisp. Crispy. They, just a little... Kind of like soft. So, almost a little stale there. I don't know. Yeah. But the guacamole was amazing. And then this, yeah. we had sweet potato soup in addition to that for yep. another starter. That was good. What I like that. I like the soup really good. Really good flavor. It was, so, good. it was good. It was supposed to have some herb croutons on top, which they did not put on top. So I don't they know forgot. Um, what happened there. or They ran out or something, but... I did put a little pepper on, um, just for a little extra flavor, but it was pretty good. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, not bad. And then for the main entree, I had the, what's called the creamy Cajun salmon pa pasta, and it was it was good. It was really kind of a creamy sauce with you know small pieces of salmon in there, but it had like a Cajun spice, so I thought it had a lot of flavor. You had a bite of it too. Yeah, it, and the pasta was very tender, mm -hmm. so it was good. Yeah, very good. I would order that again. And then Ron had, what, the baked ratatouille with butter bean mash. Yeah, it gave it a really small portion, mm -hmm. but it is really good. It's flavor, but it did fill me up, but it was good. No, that was, was what I thought, too, when you first got it. I was like, ooh. That was small. Good thing we had the two appetizers, because that was a tiny portion. Yeah. But, yeah, I had a bite of yours, too, and I thought it was good. It was good. Yeah, and then for dessert, Ron had his favorite New York cheesecake again. Only this time you had yeah chocolate uh, flavor chocolate. on it, so it was good. Yeah, and I decided to try the Florida key lime pie, and that was good. It had kind of a, I'm not even sure it was kind of a jelly almost with it, and then a, a piece of chocolate on top. The chocolate was amazing. It was kind of a bittersweet chocolate. Really good. The, the pie itself could have maybe had a little bit more punch of lime. I wasn't quite getting the lime flavor to come through, but I thought it was good overall. And especially with the little jelly there, it made it made it even better. Gave it a yeah. little extra flavor. So yeah, it was a good meal. Good meal. 
and mm -hmm. we were waiting for our dessert. Yeah. It took a lot, like a half hour to get our dessert. So mm -hmm. that, that I was... kind of got to bum about that. I like mm -hmm. it when you go boom, 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 boom. and you get, yeah. you know, but dessert took a long time. It did, and that was the one damper on the whole meal because we kind of wanted to get out because, you know, there's so much we want to get done tonight. We have reservations and just a little bit in the theater for a comedy show. So we're going to go there and check that out. I don't know if we can record in there, probably not. Uh, we're gonna go check it out. We haven't been in the theater for an actual show yet. So this will be it. And then, like I said, we're gonna go check out the White Knight party up on the deck for a little bit later. And then maybe check out a couple other venues that we haven't been to. So we'll fill you in later. We're warming up for our one night party. We continue with the next country. DJ, pop it up. Okay. for our final day four video of our cruise on the MSC Seashore, which was a sea day. And wow, did we ever have a lot of fun. Here's a few clips just to show you a little taste of what's ahead. much for watching this video on day three of our cruise on the MSC seashore. We hope you enjoyed it and learned something new and if you did please consider liking the video and subscribing to our channel. It really helps us out. Thanks so much and God bless.